We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome back to the Freak Show. I'm your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. It is time for more Might Magic Heroes 6. We just slapped our Nemesi a multitude of times. And I think we're looking really, really, really good right now. So, that's the plan, I guess, is to continue to look really, 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 really good. I don't really have any other plans. So, uh, we've already explored there. I mean, I definitely can't deal with that with no units. Eh, it's fine. I, I think we're at least safe for now. We can go out and explore and do things, and I don't think that's going to be a problem for us. Which is nice, because we have been constantly harassed by our nemesi out of these two towns. And they've always been somewhat terrifying uh, possibilities, so it is nice to see that we have somehow managed to survive these things. How far... Okay. So, the trick here is to move down here. Now, I, I want to point out that while I, I am definitely playing on the easier... Not, not easy, like normal difficulty. I'm not playing like I did on HOM 7 on the hardest difficulty. Because I got my butt kicked several times in this game. And even on normal, I've, I've had some struggles. I, I think it's less that the AI is better or anything along those lines. I think it's more along the lines of, as much as I don't want to admit it, I'm an old man and I suck. No, I'm kidding. As much as uh, I don't want to admit it, um, I think it's because they cheat, right? Like, that's always been kind of hum. At least I know in HOM 5 and I'm assuming HOM 6, probably even maybe 7. But I found 7 quite easy, but... And HOM 5 and 6, and probably... Well, you didn't really have difficulties in 3 and, and before, so... Anyway, um, they add more units, uh, both neutrals, and the enemy gets more units, more resources, and so on and so forth. I think you can even do that with, like, custom games. Like, when you can change the... Oh, I never saw them flicker out of space before. Like, when you can change, you know, the custom difficulty and all that stuff, uh, and you're just doing custom maps. I, I feel like that was the way they balanced it. So the AI always kind of worked the same. Now here, I realized if I was playing against another player or an AI that was smarter and going, well, why would I go and I attack something that's, I, I don't know, what do you, a temporary, a summoned unit instead of like charging in and making my last stand by messing up as many as I can. That makes sense to us, and that would make sense to, I guess, the a smarter AI. But we, we play into the weaknesses of the current AI, and that is what we're doing right now. Uh, we move him down here. It's the only thing he can reach. He will come down here and hit him. He'll move to probably this corner to try to be able to do more, and he might be able to do more, but, well, again, we'll see. We'll see. Like I said, play to our, to our own strengths and play to the weakness of the the AI. And that is the plan. It's the plan, man. Boy, howdy. Those archers. Alright. Well, just cuz. We'll, we'll do that. You can definitely reach my... Yeah, I figured you'd be able to. I figured you'd be able to, but I don't think you're going to live long enough for that to really matter. So, we'll see. And also, yeah, you're definitely not going to live long enough. Oh, that's going to be the end of you? Yeah. <sighs> does feel good to have our own gigantic army to face off against other gigantic armies. I do want to take a peek. I can always hop back through. It looks like there is the possibility that we'll be able to be getting our hands on maybe some resource producing buildings. I don't know. Now, I've been up for several hours today, but my voice is not keeping up with me. So I sound like I just woke up. I've literally been up for like five hours, but I have not spoken or done much talking today. So apologies as my vocals lag a little behind. It's all right, though. All right, senor. Wait. 
Uh, well, okay, we'll do this first, but I feel like I just learned something. Oh, oh, good. Oh, goody. I think this will be fine. I mean, 24 of them is a pretty sizable amount. Well, times two, I should say. Um, but, well, we'll see. We'll see how this plays. All right, Phoenix. Get him. Kaka! I guess I'll stay. Yeah. I mean, there's a few different things we could do at this point, but yeah, I guess I could stay. Oh, you lined up beautifully for me. Thank you so much. Bloop. There we go. Come on over and bring back our, our, our boys. They are back in action. Oh, you're definitely not alive anymore. Though I probably could have done that differently and it would have been fine. Looks like if I move, I don't get retaliated on. I feel like I either knew that or I didn't know that. It was like, it feels new to me, like that's a thing that I didn't know. But I must have figured this out at some point. I know uh, an episode or two ago, I was like, huh. I was like, why did I get hit now? I, I think that's what it is. So I'm going to look at our boys here after uh, out of this combat, and we're going to see what's up. All right, show me your info. How do I do that? Is there really not a way to show info on? Okay, well, we, we can go to a town and see it, I, I guess. Not really what I wanted to do. Okay. Uh huh, Sun Crusader. This basically allows us to run through things. Stacks and objects remain immune to movement reducing effects. Cool. It doesn't count as a cooldown. And then blinding charge. Sun Crusader's attacks cannot be retaliated against. And its damage is increased by 10% for each square. So th again, this is poorly worded, actually. It should say the Sun Crusader's charge attacks cannot be retaliated against. So you do still have to move if you're going to hit someone. Okay, that's fine. It's like, I, I don't feel like I, I, I remember that before. Increases the Sun Rider's damage for each square clock. So it's basically just the upgraded variant. And you have to move for it to be enacted. I know. Probably something I should have already known. It's not really a revelation to, I imagine, most of you. But, it is nice to, again, I am playing multiple Homs and other, tons of other games at the same time. I do get a little foggy on what each game brings when I don't play it after a while. So, thankfully we play this for a fair little bit here. I don't know how many episodes in we are. I've posted the very first one thus far, but that's about it. Um... Yeah, yeah, that seems fine. Even if we get like a couple hundred of those, that's gonna do just like so much work against most things. Uh, we're just gonna spend a lot of time waiting, I guess. Aha! Oh, that's that's devastating. Yeah, they're not going to make it. Odd choice of where to move, though. I mean, I, I'm not mad at it. It puts us in our normal position of how we like to deal with it. But, again, now that we have more troops, we don't really have to follow that norm. At least not 100%. Blah. And then this is just the end. Goodbye. Bloom. Teek. Yes, with, with more troops, we have a much larger range of 
doing stuff and we can do things much quicker. What does this do? Flyers receive 20% extra health. I mean, do the Seraphs count as flyers? I mean, they should, but do they? I don't know. Alright, these might be annoying. These spellcasters, or what are they? Oh, there's so many of them, too. Alright, surprise! Surprise! Alright, let's go and smack the light elementals. Elemental on elemental violence. Oh, and those seem to have a... Uh, if you attack, you get in trouble charge. Okay, well, we don't have to worry about them doing any terrible things to us. I, I don't think I want to melee these guys in general. Seems like a bad plan. Wait, does that hit everybody? Alright, well, then I'm not going to melee them at all. If that's the case. Do I get to go again? No. Did anybody actually get killed or hurt? Is it just you? All right. I believe the Griffin's flight does not count as a melee attack. Though it probably should. I also think it'd be interesting if you could change to do it in a column as opposed to a row. The Griffin uh, flight, I think that'd be pretty neat. Definitely, again, more OP. Considering everybody starts off in a line, right? Like, yeah, probably not a good idea to do that. Like I said, I have ideas. They're not all necessarily good ideas, but I have ideas. Alright, I don't know that I... Can I even explore? I guess I can explore. Gilburn. Uh, go down here and do stuff. I would like to see what is in this general region. There is a keep over there, which is cool. Oh, good. Our crystal income has been increased. Oh, well, that's super helpful and very... Aha! And very useful. I was correct. There are things. Well, that is wonderful. Okay, so also this goes through here. Nope, no it doesn't. These are different portal colors. Well, where the heck does that send me? Oh, over here. Wait, what? I'm confused. I don't know. Doesn't matter. <clears throat> it's fine. Alright, Anton. Nope, that's not Anton. Anton, I need you to do things and stuff. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Um, well, we should have a fairly... Nope. I say we should have a fairly sizable chunk of money to really... Kind of bolster our. Nope, we did, we did not. We we are uh, we're a little we're a little underwhelming. It's fine. But again, we're not going to be harried or harassed by anyone, so that's good at least. Um. No oh, good. They want to run from me. This is wonderful news. Please run from me. I don't like these guys. I don't want to fight these guys. I despise them slightly less since there's only two and I can drop a phoenix on them. But, I also think I put the phoenix in the, oh no, I can still make it. Like, I also think I put the phoenix in a terrible spot and I'm not going to be able to actually follow through and do some of the attack murder death kills that I want to do. Alright. Phoenix attack. Phoenix attack again. It's a pretty good chance I kill this. 100% chance I kill that. And a uh, good chance we hurt this really bad. Really, really, really bad. Alright. He did. 
Dead. All right, we are crushing some fools here. I feel like leaving most of the stuff on the ground is fine. What the heck is this? Oh, well, that sounds good. Also, hello. Ah, right. We have to figure out where... Whatever building that's doing the thing and stuff and junk is. That's eh, it's okay. We could technically just siege it and claim it. Alright, so some crizzle there, some stuff going on there. I, I need... Oh, wait, I can't. There's uh, light elementals that will murder me. Alright. Uh huh. I guess we go back up this way. Okay. Well, uh, you know, it it started a little rough. We started with no city, and just kind of the worst. That's interesting. Yes. Oh uh, oh oh god. Oh no. Um. I got this. Maybe. I might have this. I don't know that I have this. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, maybe. Wait, how far? Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. I can make this work. I'm back, baby. <laughs> Except I'm not. Oh, because they do the thing and the... Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we have... But we have archers that do a, just a tremendous amount of damage. And honestly, that's all we really need. Ooh, got a little worried there. I was like, ah, yeah, oh... Oh, that did not do what I thought it was going to do at all. A ring of haste. I don't think we have a ring, right? We were missing one. Hey, the ring of haste. Sweet. Uh, so we should be going first all of the time now. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I guess we could fight this. I mean, it seems unnecessary. It seems incredibly unnecessary, but sure. I think you were like there. You were there, and then the Anglais was there. The Griffins were there. I think that's my squad. Oh my goodness, you are in just most unfortunate of of places. I mean, we don't need to do this, probably, most likely, but you know what? We're gonna do it anyway because we can. Oh, you know, say he he gonna die from that alone. We, we're hitting that hard, and then we crit. Mm -mm. You done? Well, where does this portal take me to? All right. Well, like I I kind of want to stop by and clear everything out, but I also kind of want to claim the buildings so we start getting like actual production. Plus, we gotta get, find the Shantiri um, disc fragments. All right, um, that's fine. All right, I think you're outside my room. Oh no, you're not. You're perfectly in range. Very good. Q. 
He did. He also did. I, I love my ranged units. They're so nice. They just sit back, you know, they're very unassuming. They're just there. We're like, hey, we're a tier two unit. We just we just hanging out, you know. We don't really want any trouble. We just, you know, we don't want to be left alone. But you're here, you're attacking us, and we're gonna have to kill you now. And we'll do it from relative safety. Uh yeah, so this time we're just doing this. Boop! And we almost doubled what we had. It feels a little like cheating, but hey, you know what? So do, so so does the Phoenix. To, to be fair, the Phoenix feels a little bit like cheating. All right, let's kill you first. Then we'll hurt you real bad second. And then we will uh just wait for you to walk forward. And then we'll end you. Bye. Boop. That shield really didn't hold up. Lovely. Alright, lovely, 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 lovely. Um, and probably not necessary that we pick it up. Where does this take me? Where the heck is this? Okay, I mean, I guess... Well, it looks like this map is going to take a little longer than initially intended. But that's also okay, I suppose. Um, guess I'll do the, the footwork with Kilburn. Kilborn? Kilburn. Kilburn. Now we'll kind of get to see some stuff going on. Okay. Hey, look at that. We found a fort. I don't know if, like, all right, let's actually see what our objective is here, because it's, it's been a little bit of time. All right, we found one of the four discs, sure. Stairway to heaven, finish the objective, capture, capture the fort to open the gate, capture one of the forts to destroy the corresponding barrier. I, I don't, okay. True heroes never die. As the fate of Ashan hangs in the balance, the time has come for true heroes to rise and face their destinies. Your main hero must not be defeated in battle. Which is the exact... Why is that even an objective? You you never can lose your main hero in battle, can you? Am I, am I wrong? I feel like that's been, like, from the beginning of time. That has been how this has gone. Uh, uh, if he is to decide the outcome of the conflict and shape the future of the world, a true hero... Cannot be a craven either, so retreating or surrendering is also forbidden. That's funny. Yeah, no, you can't do that anyway. Why, why is that even there? Oh, sorry, we, we missed one. And then uh, Tabula Rasa. To stop Michael, or Michael, and his celestial legions reigniting the Elder Wars, the Dragon Knight Kate decided to perform a ritual to send the souls of the angels who died during the Elder Wars onto Elrath thus preventing the creation of the new Celestials. To complete the ritual, the fort protecting the Hall of Memories must be captured and held for seven days. Okay, um, yeah. I don't know what this is going to do if we do eventually end up claiming that, so... That's a thing. Can't you just join me? Ugh... Okay, we gotta be a little bit careful of this. This could go very, very sideways. You know what? It could go so sideways, in fact, that... I am willing to bet that it is a bad idea to put you boys and or girls in, on the front lines. Yeah, I think so. And I think we just slap you here, maybe? It's not really the, the goal or the dream here, but... Oh yeah, you're just... Never mind, that, that works out just fine. Alright. Because they're, they're not going to commit to moving, so... This is great. 
and then they can get slapped back by this. It's it's fine. This is literally the perfect scenario for us. All right, so now we have a couple of options. I'm going with this one because it just makes more sense. And uh, we'll see how this goes. Aha! All right, now... I can definitely kill this, but I didn't, but I did, and it's all good. I like how he got to cheer and rejoice that he killed someone, and then he got to continue. All right, safety first on that one. Again, yes, we could afford to lose units, but I, I mean, I've done enough sloppy play in this uh, scenario already that uh, I think it's a good idea not to play poorly, if possible. Which I think is definitely possible, so. Alright, plopping you down over here, you back in this general vicinity, you here, you here, oops, too far. And you up there, alright, let's get it. Bloop! Um, yeah, let's do it. Wait, wait, wait. Work, work. Alright. Big hit number one, and victory. There it is. Work, work. Okay, snag that. Snag this. Again, not really what I'm after. I'll get more phoenixes that I have to deal with. Alright, I'm going to step forward slightly. Try to reveal a little bit more of what's going on over here, but I don't really know what's happening. Uh, for some reason, I have an idea. Uh, uh, I'm feeling like that might be a Shantiri moon disc. I'm probably wrong, but in my mind, that's what that is. So we'll see if that's actually true. Or not. That's really cool about our current situation. You can't move. She still gets a shot at us, even if we uh, charge forward like that. That's interesting. I think I, again, I feel like I already knew that, but still, it's good to reinforce these uh, things that we already knew. I mean, we just dropping a lot of things. My goodness, our archers are just terrifying. Now go ahead, retaliate against me, I don't care. I'm scared. Please don't scare me. Tee hee. Well, you know what would have been smart had I uh, used her ability to heal and then just like messed him up? Oh, that's unfortunate. This is probably enough to take you out. I'm just saying. Probably got this. Alright, cool. Nope, it's a chest of endless gold. Also super important. But we do need to meet up with uh, someone and use that. Hell, it looks like I was, I was thinking maybe like two, three, maybe five more episodes. It's probably going to take me five episodes just to clear out the map at this point. I'm going to try to do things quickly. But I cannot promise that that's how it's going to go. Uh, sure. Wow. A single shot from our archer. That's not, uh, it's not normal. Yeah, nothing you can do. Oh, you can definitely hurt some fools. Oh, that's gonna leave a mark. Oh, I did not, I did not count that. I didn't think about that. That was uh, that was good. Just to show that despite what I'm trying to do at this point, I'm still making some silly moves. Uh, our Anglais are fine, though. Alright, and go. 
Goodbye. All right. I think we're going to break off the episode right here. And in the next episode, again, we'll continue our exploration and so on and so forth. Until then, I have been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. We play, we fight, we conquer.